City leaders say over 800 people in 2021 were experiencing homelessness, but there's a local nonprofit that's looking to help out. Nine on your side, Tina Giuliano is joining us live with more on this project. Good morning, Tina. Good morning, Lydia. Yeah, the Homing Project aims to give people a roof over their head as well as resources to help them get back on their feet. And these homes can be set up in less than an hour. There's no affordable housing. Well, you know, we uh, sort of foresee this being, you know, as long term as the person needs. They're called micro homes, small structures complete with everything from beds to air conditioning. They're these tiny, like kind of like dorm like uh, structures uh, that are sort of the freestanding. They um, they have locks on the doors, beds, storage space, AC. The homing project team aims to set up 30 of these homes here in town with uh, communal bathrooms and showers. Uh, as well as uh, wraparound services like, um, you know, access to, to um, uh, medical uh, to treatment um, for, for uh, illnesses. And these homes can be easily disassembled. Such a low risk for such a huge gain. This is based on a pallet shelter model used in over 55 other cities. Garawal says it was important to bring this to Tucson. At the same time, I mean, there are tons of people on the street who do not want to be on the street, and that is not fair. Um, and uh, and we'd like to do everything we can to, you know, end that. So while they'd like to keep the location of this community under wraps for now, Garwal told me that they aim to have the project ready for residents to move in later this year around November. Tina Giuliano, Kega 9 on your side.